we don't know for sure, but it looks like next year we'll we can we can do a drop. No commitment yet because the things that you know, what do you what do you can't promise? And the fun pimps are back with some hot off the presses info about their console. First off, discounted version for existing owners, maybe release next year. Try to servers crossplay. What other features is their ambition for console? Let's listen to Rick, who is one of the founders of the fun pimps something that isn't isn't uh running on all the hardware with all features uh we have intended for it to release uh, but there's a possibility to get it out next year with an interim release and then do another release for gold that's our hope as i speculated earlier there was a chance of an interim release rather than waiting another two years or more for full release let's hope this happens but what about the existing owners as far as legacy console version people, we do have a strong desire to discount the game, new game for those players. And uh, But again, that's in Microsoft and Sony's uh, realm. They have to agree to this. And if it's even technically possible, given the fact that the original SKU was owned by Telltale and is, is a different back end than what we have. As you can see, it's a complicated nest there. And uh, we, we're trying to navigate it and make all parties happy at the same time. This time we're paying for it, so we're able to make those decisions that are proper to make it so it can be a unified code base that supports hopefully all SKUs the same way. Um, we are excited that we have an external team working on it, and they're, they've been working on it for a few months, six months or so, and uh, they're ramping up and they're making some progress. We're getting more hardware for our developers to support it with them. And um, our hope, I mean, there's a lot of factors in this thing, you know. Um, basically, we'd like to support full res, textures, full draw distance, 10K worlds, persistent service for console players, and cross-play. And there's a lot of work and a lot of technical uncertainty surrounding these goals. Sony and Microsoft have to sign off on those things. You can't just say, I want to do cross-play. They have to say, yeah, we, we'll let you. We, you've made a good re you've given us a good reason to want to support that. and green light that because it is their hardware it's not ours so we are just uh hoping that they will support those decisions so they got a bunch of ambitions for console parity as much as possible with pc but as they highlight crossplay and some features do require sony and microsoft to agree to it what do you think are you a console player and feel heartened by the console news why not leave your views in the comment section below and a big thanks to guns nerds and steel for his tfp interview leave a like and subscribe for more